With so many organizations talking about talent exodus and internal talent marketplaces, as well as employer brand, uh, there's no place that you should uh, pay attention to more than these next four or five minutes as I walk you through the highlights of our latest talent acquisition next practice monthly series as we featured Sina Harbinson from Ecolab and shared a bunch of their story from a talent acquisition perspective. You know, she set the table in terms of the diversity of their business globally and really gave gave us uh, an excitement around their employer brand that focuses on science and innovation. Uh, I was ready to lean in and start to apply for a job uh, as I started to think about, one, they've set a strong direction for strategic TA that thinks about the 10,000 hires that they make globally each year and how that can be scalable in an efficient process. Uh, part of the secret sauce becomes how do they ensure that they create a toolkit that's built for TA, HR, and hiring managers to really create this campaign compelling candidate experience, but it has to go beyond the external candidate experience. It really has to translate into the internal side. We asked the participating organizations to tell us, number one, do they have a compelling employer brand for their candidates and employees? Only 22% reported saying, yes, it's current and compelling. Uh, most organizations either fell into this, hey, it's got limits, especially as we talk about role and region, um, but the majority of them actually said, nope, it needs updating. We also dove into a question for the participants around, do they have a dedicated role or team focused on internal candidate experience? And what we found was 3% have uh, a role that's greater than 75% dedicated to the internal candidate experience. The majority basically said they have something that's less than 75% or nothing at all. And that really told us that there's some work to be done as organizations around how do we think differently about the internal candidate experience. Again, especially as we're trying to create more talent mobility, but we don't want to ghost our own employees. We want them to stay here and find unique opportunities. What Ecolab did was then said, you know, let's break it down into some major lanes. Let's think about the experience from a technology standpoint. Is it visible? Second, do we have the right workflow so that we can make job alerts to associates uh, that basically mitigates the hoarding from a manager standpoint and actually says, you know what, let's go directly to the people that have the right matching capability. Uh, as well, they wanted to make sure that they had some good mechanisms for surfacing feedback.